So, after all of that excitement of fighting against cats, I have completed us to check what I was going to do. Let's see. Come on, da, 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 da. I've got a lot of money. I don't really want to use it on. Well, I don't really want to use it on any of this because it feels like I'm just gonna develop the new set of command text because I'm not gonna use any of that anyway. I don't want to use any of that. Modules. Diet Cola. Plus V to everything. That's. Insane. In the Japanese version, the cola is called Hepsi, so. Uh, they've got brand naming already. Uh, it, oh, what was I going to say? Never mind. Uh, even more move. Who needs that when you've got curry? Shooting range, plus two. Mm, 100,000. Target area, plus one. Target area, plus one can get very dangerous if your tanks already have shooting range and target area uh, equal, because that means they're gonna hit themselves. It might be fun with like hickories and stuff because they have a uh, large frame so they can take a hit, but uh, your small tanks will just suicide themselves with it, so be careful with it. Human tank bomb, infinite range, nuke the entire field, everything dead. Might be great with like a Gonta and Teshiko and then uh, you just nuke everything, but like in the earlier map that would have done nothing because. One of those cats would have dodged that you would have completely lost. If uh, everything dies, uh, including your, uh, all of your command tanks, uh, you still win. because uh, So in a tie, you do win. So uh, at least you get that. How much is that? 10, th 10 million? Oh boy. Uh, no, it, nobody got to deal with that. Okay, can it, oh yeah, you can refight cat. I don't think you do uh, recruit him again after that though. Infiltrate the Nagoya Tower. That so we're still at Nagoya then. After everything that happened, Shotaro and his fellows decided to relieve their tired bodies at the command post. And it happened in the afternoon. There you go. I think I got it now. The price is still down. I suppose I should short belt I should short sell this brand. Oh my, what's going on in this room? The atmosphere is so laid back! Choco is playing with a portable game console and eating snacks. Sato is checking stock prices of interest from the newspaper, and Shoto is adding some fine dirt onto one of his plastic models. Ah, uh, I thought they were still uh, playing together like, I don't know, Monopoly? Dang, now I paid it too much! Oof, that's... Yeah, that. Like, if you paint uh, onto the put uh, paint on the model in the wrong place, you can paint over it, uh, find it and all that decorative stuff, uh, yeah, good luck getting that off again. He seems to have messed up a little. N not just Lieutenant, it's like Lieutenant Choco, even second like Lieutenant Satoru is relaxing. What is going on here, ma'am? Ah, I suggest we should take a day off today, because things have been going well with our army and we have no orders for the moment. I kept telling Satoru to have a couple of days off work because she's always working so hard, but she wouldn't listen. Persistent, are you? You have to act according to, to situation. That's why I'm having rest like this today. Yeah, and you're still kind of doing work on the side with your short signing. Oh, I see. It's pretty rare for this sort of thing to happen. But Hashiko, you human tanks have no vacation. Shock! I already expected that, but I still can't help feeling sad. I heard that real capable workers take the time resting up properly, even if they are overloaded with work. It must be true if Big Bro says so. Choco will rest up properly as well. You spend every day as if it were a holiday, Lieutenant. Oh, I almost forgot. What do we get for lunch today? How about fried rice? It's easy to make. Sato, are you going to cook as part of your staff officer role? You don't have to because you're off duty today. Not doing something I do on a daily basis makes me feel somewhat awkward, though. What will you do? Pizza delivery? Well, um... What is it, Ashiko? Well, um... What? You have something to say for us? What is it, girl? Uh, no, there's nothing, sir. You totally sound like there is. So, what is that envelope you are holding? No, this is nothing. There's no commission or any such thing, sir, ma'am. Well then, it appears that we have to postpone our days off. Um... You idiot, Hashiko. Why the hell did you bring it to us? You insensitive dummy! You know we were having a rest! Uh, this is exactly why I did want to bring this here. I suppose I should get moving before I get used to this. 
Huh? So, so did you just say something? I said nothing. Let's just all prepare for the expedition now. Nagoya. The city lies right in the middle of the Eastern Invasion route, and is one of the most crucial holdings for the Royal Army. On the outskirts of the city stands a shining tower surrounded by the Imperial Army. It is the Nagoya Long Range Telecommunications Tower, commonly known as the Nagoya Tower. So, this is that infamous Nagoya Tower. It's beautiful! What a big and shining tower! It's splendid! Well, if you take this as a side thing too, we can still feel like we're on vacation, eh, Sato? What are you saying? We're currently in the middle of a campaign. Get rid of such feeling. <laughs> It'd be cool to make a human tank as shiny as that tower! Do, do not look at me, please! Sato, we've got no time for admiring this tower. Let's go. Uh, I'm not that admiring anything. Thank goodness, you come. Is there something? Is there something so important inside the tower? Yes, the Royal Army is hiding intelligence on the new home model tank inside. But we can't get in because of the opponent human tanks occupying it. Correct? That's right. Such pain in the ass. What if we just blow up the tower? We cannot do such a thing. If we did that, we would lose the intel also. That means that all we can do is sneak in and destroy the tanks one by one. I'm counting on you. The tanks in there are using some kind of strange magic. Magic? Aren't this the new model tanks in question? So, are you going to be fighting the new weapon? Really? That's so exciting, isn't it? You're the only one who thinks so. Well then, we're commencing the operation. Ishiko, pick the best members and break into the tower. What is that, sir? What's that about? Okay, I can uh, build Chito. No, I can build Nanako. Big bro! <laughs> uh, just faster, basically has. That's equivalent to Heshiko, so she's just a bit weaker than Heshiko. This is basically Heshiko, but uh, with uh, extra free model slot that doesn't isn't a bit by the scarf. Who cares? Uh, uh, okay, whatever. I was going to pick uh, formation. Let's see. So, yep, still tower shape. Apparently, this is a vertical map. Gonna guess that uh, this command tank and the spire up there. Hmm. Small area, six tanks only. This is so. I'm definitely gonna bring Hikari. Um, Kodama just for cleaning up. Maybe a Tama. Hmm. Do I? Yeah, I can. I can pack a. a bar. Yeah, I, th I think I can. So let's place you. Himawari, uh, you get like down here. Which one is a good Hikari? Yeah, you. The one with the cola. Uh, Kodama, you get on the side, and then Tama just here. And how much do I have left? One. Yeah, let's uh, let's get the Ryome in there. I haven't developed Yukihime yet, so whatever. Uh, that's not the battle preparation slot. Oh, whatever. Let's. See how this works. Okay, get a move on. Um, so I'm gonna have to be careful of shock tanks. No. Where was that? Uh, evasive action at X eight Y nine. That's right there. I can't reach it. Bugger. So let's hope there's something up. Uh, that's the new tank. You uh go into. That's not where I wanted you to go. Whatever. So uh my Himawari is going to be positively useless here. Wonderful. This is why uh, barrage tanks are no good. They just uh, on top of all the other issues they have, like their low speed and mobility. Uh, you're gonna have to deal with a lot of enemies that evade, and they're basically never gonna hit. And oh, come on! You're not even a barrage tank. Well, I've got two hits in at least. Um, yeah, that's one of them. This, I guess. That. Oh no! Kodama is gonna 
Hmm. This is a bit of a gamble now. I hope I can hit it, but it's not... Yeah, see. She's no good. Uh, I do not have... Um... Oh, bugger, she can't reach. Well... Those two are no good. So yeah, that's how uh, that's how the night tanks work. They're basically, shock tanks that don't self-destruct, and they um, and they dodge everything on top of that. So uh, good luck. Get it, get it. Come on! I guess I'm just gonna have to uh, keep an eye out on them there. Uh. Sal, please. So, I lost the Kodama. That's a bit. Unfortunately, they can only hit like one tile of Hikari at once. So, they're not likely to actually kill her. But it's a pain to cope with them. Uh, intercept, I do not want any barrage tanks getting in the way. Okay, that's... Oh, she cannot actually uh, hit them. Well, it's an intel is intel. Moving up in the world, are we? So basically my goal is to find the command tank and kill it. Fortunately, the night tanks don't count as command tanks, they're still truck tanks. Uh, yeah, they have a barrage tank. That's bad. I should not have moved. Uh, please hit. Not. Yeah. I think I should re evaluate the hit chance. Maybe like 10% more like. Assault tanks are more like 50 50, I'm thinking. Yeah, that's a good one. Now, I'm gonna have to deal with the uh, barrage tank. I think that's only two left. Barrage and command. Oh, no, it's just... Uh... Well, then, it's just... Uh... What are your stats? Shooting range four, shooting range area two. Boy, howdy. What the hell is that command tank? That's uh... not pretty. Uh, you die, please. So, uh, this is a very easily farmable map, I think. Just get a Gonta with a, with a good strong nuke up there. <laughs> 100,000. Pretty decent. 60,000 on the loss, so good map to farm uh, with just cheap throwing fights, I guess. Captain, we destroyed the enemy! Good. Now get back down here. Big bro! I think that new tank is... Wait, Captain, there's still one left alive. It's almost just the tower exit. Battery units, prepare to fire. Understood. Here it comes! Ah! Fire! Yeah. Yeah, no. No, you did not get it. It dodged the attack! Ha! Shock tanks, go! Shock tanks, go! Wrong foot. Roger that. Did you finish it? Looks like we were able to take it down this time. Yes, yeah, basically it's telling you barrage tanks use the shock tanks the way to go. But the missiles we launched are perfectly aimed at the enemy unit. How did they fail to hit the target? Well, like, the target evaded them. Evaded? That tank is exactly like the samurai tank that our army used to field. Samurai tank? I've never heard of those. Can you explain what it is? She was a kind of shock unit, but she used a katana for fighting except for self instead of self-destructing. So, smart. Yeah, fight smarter, not uh, harder. The most remarkable feature of the tank is that she was capable of evading enemy attacks using the large overcoat she wore. Such capable of evading attacks? Had, I hadn't known that such a cheat of a tank ever existed. But that way an army tank looked more like a knight than a samurai! Maybe we should call her a knight tank or something. Uh, yes, that sort of unit is on the opponent's side. This is just a guess, but the Royal Army might have gotten hold of one of our samurai tanks and used the technology to build that tank. Wait a moment, does our army have any such tanks at the moment? None right now. Hey, Choco, could you assemble them again? Again? Hmm, I guess I'll be able to develop and assemble them if I have enough materials! Yeah, it's basically it's telling you just to develop them as normally. So you also created the earlier samurai tanks, the second lieutenant Shoko. Uh-huh, and she's a samurai tank as well! Who is? 
Mio. Ah, that human tank. It's pretty hard to make another Mio, but, but there's no problem if it's just a mass production type you want. That's that's heartening. Alright then, let's return to our post. Yeah, too bad we had to spend the holiday like this. Guess I'll go home and catch some sleep. Excuse me, but what about the intelligence on the new tank model? Yes. So, developing uh, the... where was it? Looks pretty awesome actually. All in black with the goggles and stuff. Um, so, it says it performs as well as a shock tank. I think they're actually a bit slower and they're a lot more expensive obviously since they're not disposable. Pretty decent. Uh, I think they also have the shock tank accuracy so good against other uh, samurai tanks or night tanks I guess. Uh, yeah, sure, let's develop them. Uh, for the rest... Yeah, might as well, I... Uh, okay, I need three Mies, let me just assemble them. I have no intention of using the bigger scout tanks, or the bigger... Uh, thing. I think I need to build one of those uh, to develop the higher shock tanks as well. Let's see, what's the uh, tank? Yeah, there we go. Need five quarters and cost 40,000. Uh, massive explosion and destroys enemies far and wide. So I think this one has even a larger target area than the earlier ones that are just built. Forty thousand seems affordable. Let's go, 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 go. One, two, three, four, five. Just shove them all inside the bomb. There we go. That's all the cheap tanks. Developed uh, modules. Let's build the cheap stuff as well. I don't need any of those, but let's get it out of the way. Uh, these are all the dumb stuff that I don't care about. Traffic insurance. It's one use only. Yeah, no. Saving again. Yeah, sure. Um. Not gonna redo that battle again, just gonna move on. Hold on. You don't want to. I don't, you don't want to leave yet. What do you fight for? Have you not noticed it? Your enemy. They stand right beside you. Are you sure that tank's recovered? Hold on, big bro. You don't want to get close to her yet. Die, Shotaro! Yeah, uh, Lieutenant! God, she fired a rifle. I told you not to get close to her! Where am I? This is a military post! <laughs> Choco act like a beast to bring you back to life! Thank goodness you came back! Ugh. You could have left before watching the surgery and made you crazy enough to make to want to vomit. Uh, yeah, still like biomechanical, I guess you'll... Fixing them is like surgery, so very messy. Uh, how could I leave my senior officers alone with an enemy tank? I'm supposed to be a god as well as the staff officer. <laughs> <laughs> Watching a human tank surgery might be a little bit hard for on their first time, especially their parts and such. They're all squishy and gooey. Actually, it does are more like entrails. So don't feel free to use the bathroom. <laughs> Here she go. Got the lieutenant while I'm away. <laughs> now, excuse me. Oh, Captain, we're second lieutenant Satoni going, sir. Don't worry about her. Alright oh, then, first things first. Do you want me to explain what's going on? Not necessary. But Rara knows she's been captured, repaired, and restrained here. Why did you fix Rara? Rara, you're a human tank that belongs to that belongs to that royal commander, right? Kurara Ikura, I believe. Choco fix you up on a whim. On a whim? Exactly! You didn't blow up even though you got hit! That in fact made Choco too excited to leave you alone. <laughs> Curiosity killed the No, no, no. Curry and Nukes killed the cats. Get it right. Sato, are you alright already? Uh Secret Lieutenant! You're not too firm on your legs. I'm fine. Please go on. Can't you believe this human tank may nick egg? Never. Ah, oh, I see. Neither can I, Lieutenant. Who would fix an enemy human tank without converting it? Indeed. You didn't even remove Rara's weapon from her. That was the first thing I tried to do, but Shoko insisted on keeping it on you. Look at the beautifully crafted long barrel on her rifle! It should definitely stay as it is! Just like that. 
Rara was ordered to kill Shotaro. She will be able to execute that order immediately. Lieutenant, there's a question that's been bothering me. What's that? Do you not think this tank's speech is somewhat advanced for a human tank? Uh, how do you mean? Human tanks are supposed to be stupider! That's what you tried to say, right, Sato? Exactly. Besides that, she's holding herself back from killing you. I don't suppose that this is just another regular human tank. Yeah, she's basically a uh, Hashiko level intelligence, I would guess. Well, Hashiko isn't the brightest bulb uh, either, but uh, yeah. In other words, most human tanks are simple and short-sighted. Isn't that right, Hashiko? Why are you asking me that, man? Okay, scratch it, she's just as dumb. <laughs> Colonel Kurara, she had Rara's thinking capacity enhanced. Enhancing a human tank's thinking capacity? Does the kingdom do research in that field? Yes, Rara is several times smarter than an ordinary human tank. Strengthening human tank's ability to think! That's taboo. Choco finally figured out where Rara didn't fall when she got hit. Could you elaborate? All human tanks share the instinct that makes them explode when they feel they reach their limits, but you use her rational mind to suppress that! That's fascinating. I never imagined such a thing was possible. Where is Colonel Kurara? Is she safe? You wanna know? Shh. What is with that smug look on your face? If I tell you, will you fight for my corpse? Shotaro, Rara can fight against your corpse, but she cannot fight for your corpse. Oh well, I knew that. That's natural, we didn't fiddle with her beyond fixing her body. Your boss is still alive, she escaped after the battle. Why did you tell Rara that? She still won't join your corpse. I'm sorry, but that's because your boss might die soon enough. The Imperial Army finally reached the Royal Capital, and the HQ has ordered the entire army to assault it. My corpse will be there as well, and that might kill your boss. You will not! Christ, so close! You gotta warn me before shooting! Second Lieutenant, Second Lieutenant Choco, are we done here? We were supposed to depart already, we have to prepare ourselves post haste. Big hmm. bro! Wanna come with us? Maybe we'll get to see your boss there. The end of the decisive battle in Shinyuku. Shinyuku. This is a vestibule of the area under Kingdom's direct control. Its army final defense line. The end of the eastern invasion route. And the last battlefield. Although the Imperial Army now holds overwhelming military strength, the Royal Army is using everything it has to start trying to stop them. Human tanks explosions blossom into red spots of lights here and there, as if attempting to illuminate the vast city. Even though this climactic battle was to end shortly, the fantastic performance of a certain royal company has forced it to drag on. Are there people in that image? This does not look like a war zone. The name of the company is the Ikura Regiment on a mission to overtake the Imperial Capital. Ah, I think you need rebranding. The regiment is no longer on its mission, nor does it possess fo its former war potential. Regardless, Kurara Ikura is the only royal family member who didn't flee to the royal capital. Team 5, prepare to fire! All prepared! Draw them closer. Enemy spotted! Charging! Fire! My tanks! Sweep them all out! Ah! Yeah, that's definitely people. Shock units! Block the third transport route and destroy every enemy that comes from the second transport route! Copy that! Colonel Kurara, I believe you should take a rest. Ah, what are the other companies doing? They are all in the last legs. I believe you have to retreat to them soon enough. My regiment is finally going strong enough to seize victories like this. But that's pointless when there's no one following us. You need to rest, ma'am. Or you need to make the decisions to withdraw. Not so fast. Shotaro's not here yet. Until I take him down. Until then, I'm not giving up. Oh, what was that? They broke through the, the transport route. Trouble. They're coming, Colonel Kurara. Enemy identified. It is... The Imperial Army, f the Imperial Fourth Armored Corps. Here you come, Shotaro. We meet again. Looks like you're doing pretty well for yourself. Of course, I've been doing everything I can just to beat you down. Colonel Kurara. Rara, Rara, you alive? Rara apologizes that she's been captured, ma'am. You coward, Shotaro. I'm so offended. What did I do to be called a coward? You've taken Rara as a hostage. Interesting. So this human tank has value as a hostage, huh? Usually human tanks are abandoned by the commanders upon capture. Ah, uh, give Rara back to me! Shoko. You got it, big bro! What's this all about? You wanna go back to her, right? Go ahead! What? You're releasing her? 
Hey, just go already. You'll regret this later. Ara! Thank goodness you're safe! Ara apologizes for worrying you, Colonel Kurara. <sighs> if we had kept that enemy attack on our side, it might have given us an edge. Then again, you didn't do anything to stop us from letting her go, did you, Sato? I have no idea what you're talking about. Why did you do this, Shotaro? Is this your idea of charity? I'm just showing you some respect. Respect? That human tank of yours didn't explode when she got attacked. Do you have any idea why not? What are you talking about? We must seize victory here in Shinjuku. What? Therefore, we must let your Rara explode here. Are you going to break her? This is unlikely going to be... This is likely going to be the last battle between us. Big bro! Shoko believes in you! Settle everything here! Hashiko? Sir, yes sir! Get ready to fight, and I'll give you just one order. Destroy Rara. Shotaro Dayane! I swear I'll finish you here! Yumi Shirogahara, Kasa Matsumoto, Nagoya, and then Nikonaka Cape. Many battles have been fought between Shotaro and Kurara Ikura. At the ancient Yuku, the final reckoning is about to begin. All tanks, prepare to sortie! Prepare to sortie! Roger that! Rara, are you good to go? No problem, ma'am. Rara will definitely bring you victory. We won't lose to him! Move out! Ah, oh, that's a showdown. Uh, bye. Let's take a look at the rat. Oh, that red. That's everywhere I've won a battle. A couple of maps on the northern route I haven't done. One of the very near the Imperial Capital, I wonder what that's about. And then uh, Shinjuku, that's where I'm at right now, I guess. No, wait, I'm in, Na I'm in Nagoya, isn't it? Oh, oh well. Uh, the map itself, pretty open. Like, uh... The Hikari's will have no problem moving anywhere here. Hmm. Alright, let's see. I'm guessing uh, Kotama on the eastern right, just to keep that clear. Probably a god like uh, an explode in a shock tank. Maybe a knight. I'm gonna have to. Hmm. So I think, I'm fairly sure I want to capture the southern area of Rig Pass, so that's where I'm gonna focus my uh, Hikaris. So the good Hikari will cover the lower edge. The weaker one. Hmm. Here, a bit more flexible. Alright, Kodama here. Kodama here. Uh, what about the tanks I can build? Koro Koro. Shooting area 3. Oh yeah, that's really big. I... What's speed? Speed 3? That's not so good. I think I'm gonna build just one for the eastern route, and then... Sikigahara. Speed 3, move 3. Shooting area 2, so we're just neighboring area. Scouting range 3, but only scouting area 1, so I finish 2. Yeah, sure, a couple. So, Koro Koro, uh, up here, just to. Uh, Tsukigahara, like. Mm, yeah. Actually, how fast are the Hikaris? Three, yeah, okay, that's good. And the other Tsukigahara, uh. Yeah. And I guess a couple of good. Like a Kodama more. Or two. Uh, I also need to deploy Hashika, right? So she can go down here. Kodama here, Kodama here. And I still have uh, like four spots left. What do I even want? I guess I can put a. Yeah, sure, why not? Imawari. You go there. Is there anything I can uh, give her to make her better? Intercept, intercept range? Nah. Modern strength moves, getting her shooting range. Like, do I have shooting area plus one? No, I didn't buy that, right. So, modern moves as just as expensive as developing them, not really too exciting. 
I need to build one of each if I want to get the upgraded versions, but even then, those are redundant by the curry. <laughs> uh, I guess I'm just going to assemble a Gonta with a bomb and have her go at them. They're, they're cheap by now, I, I can't deal with. i uh, gonna have to need one of you move away. Alright, you handle that. System save. Uh, da, 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 da. Sortie. Did I place uh, Himawari? Ten. Yes, I did. I, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. You sh just. Okay, good. And then let's move up here. Excellent. Destroy. Good, that was a bit of a, a gamble again. Yeah! Oh, baby, that's beautiful. Yes! Please! Ah, shock tanks are wonderful. Oh, and there's another one right here. Got to map the X4. You, uh, move ahead. Oh! You can't reach it yet, so I'm just gonna have you here attack up there and take out whatever that was. Oh, that's one that I did know about. Alright, and the Kodamas are uh, gonna... Sure. Yes. And I didn't even abuse anything that I brought with, uh, uh, with my... Okay, that was maybe a dumb idea, but I can just move her away. With that I bought with all that money, so I guess that was just a very smart move to have that the daisy bomb there. Sticky guards are really good as decoys, like even beyond shock tanks, because you know they can actually take a hit and not die. Oh no, they have uh, their own Higari equivalent. I have an idea where this is though. That's good news for me. Can I? Okay, it's up there. So, like, I'm thinking these four tiles. Uh oh. That is really bad. Took out three of mine. That. Ah. Touche. Well, still advantage for me. Uh, let's go up here. Okay. Recon. Nothing. Yes. Um, sure. Something there, and it's a big one. Uh, that might have been bad positioning. That uh, opens them up for abuse. Bit late for that though. Okay, there's a command tech nearby. Very good. That means I can retaliate and hopefully win. Uh, you move here. Okay, that's where she is. Okay, that was a uh, interception. No, so what was that thing that was uh, hitting me? That was like hitting up there. I wonder. So command tank down, interceptor. Nice. That means my Himawari will have a bit more freedom to act. Uh, yeah, maybe maybe it was up here and I just. Oh, it is up there. It is here, like. Here, that is uh, an 
Oh, oh, oh. Okay, sure. Let's say here. Okay, that is good. Two interceptors down. Interceptors are really not a high priority target unless you really love to spam barrages, and even then, uh. Okay. Haha! <laughs> already made a already good investment. So, uh. Yeah, I'm not gonna kill that assault tank, unfortunately, but, uh, winning five, good enough for me. How did it? 150,000, that's good value right there. Good fight, except for one that, uh, for that one bomb that got my uh, frontliners there. Kurara! Kuno Kurara, it's dangerous to go there. She came back one life once. She should be able to do it again. That isn't going to happen. You also saw. So I completely explode. That's a lie. That's a blasted lie. Everything has been settled between them. Kurare Ikura could not defeat Shotaro even once, even if the, uh, the fevered human tank was lost. Shotaro claimed yet another victory. After the sacrifice of so many human tanks that worship him, countless uphill battles and many uh, victories. Oops. He in the end held, in the end, completely destroyed the Imperial Capital Conquering Regiment. Lieutenant. Big bro! However, Shotaro had another purpose in his mind. Rara. Why didn't you come out already? Your boss spawning like a baby. Colonel Kurara. Rara! Rara, you're alive! This can't be true. You exploded in front of our very eyes. How on earth did you survive? Rara doesn't know, ma'am. What is this thing? Rara she is wearing a crimson cloth around her arm. Colonel Kurara. Rara thinks it's this clustering. That cloth? That red cloth saved your life! You should be joking around at a time like this. She's right! What? That's a body called Red Ruffler! And human tanks equipped with it can return safely, even if she blows up! Even if she blows up? That's impossible! It's possible! I too am equipped with one of this. They come back alive, even when I get hit and explode, like 60 times, 80 times. <laughs> red Muffler. Shotaro, are you the one who put that in the Rara? To be more accurate, Choco did. Choco had to do it! Rara was so beautifully built that Choco didn't want to let it explode! Why? Why would you do that? You people are my opponents, aren't you? You can't figure out what is going on! Shotaro had to not have in mind. Rara Ikura, I'm sorry, but you are the loser here, so I'm going to make good use of you. What do you mean? What are you thinking? His excellent stuff officer and his little sister are starting to realize his intentions. Sato, no need to worry, I'll show you your feelings on the matter now, Lieutenant. Sure? You finally made up your mind, huh, big bro? Choco believed in you! Let me at least finish speaking. Sorry, but Choco's too happy now! Shotaro Dayone, what in the world are you thinking? I've been holding myself I've been holding myself back until now, but I guess I can't do that anymore. Once the Imperial Army has conquered the Royal Capital, all of Japan will be in the palm of the Empire's hand. Therefore, this is our last remaining opportunity. So we are going to fight the b final battle in the Royal Capital? No! This will, that will be the first battle! Hmm. I suppose so. Shotaro! What are you planning to do? We are rebelling against the Empire! Fellows, at last we have made it here. <laughs> the kingdom only has its capital left. Easy, how very easy. But how are we going to deal with him? People now consider him and his corpse heroes. There's nothing to be concerned about. I have some intriguing information. I see. Do you mind sharing with us? Shotaro Daihone has captured the third heir to the royal throne. What? He got a member of the royal family? I couldn't believe it. That fact just makes him shine brighter. I see. That intelligence indeed is interesting. <laughs> You'll be finished soon, Shotaro Daihone. That's what you think. Well, that was a massive turn of events. Um, so I guess next time uh, we're going to fight for the kingdom and rebel against the army to get the empire. Finally, time to kick them in the dick.